When I cruise around the other parts of the town, I got my decal and back. So be true to your school now. We know that face, that voice, and the ukulele. She is the one, the only Grace Vanderwall, and she's making her feature film debut on Disney Plus with Star Girl, also starring Graham Vershare. Hi, guys. Hi. Thank you guys so much for coming in. Thank you for having me. Oh, my gosh. Like I told you backstage, I was such a huge fan of the mm. Star Girl book. I read it so many times when I was younger. So the fact that we finally Lots of have this <laughs> as a movie on Disney Plus. First of all, how are you guys feeling knowing that on Friday everyone's going to get to see this movie? I'm so excited. <laughs> I can't wait. It's been forever. We filmed, we started filming September 2018. Yeah. So mm -hmm. we've been waiting a while and I can't wait. Oh my gosh. Well, Grace, of course fans know and love you from America's Got Talent, our winner. But then you transition from making music to starring in a feature film. How are you feeling? I am so nervous. <laughs> I don't, I try not to think about it, honestly. I'm, I don't know if I'm ready for people to see this. <laughs> it's a really good movie, though. It's really cute. Definitely. What was it like for both of you guys to be on set to really stretch your acting job? Well, he's he's acted for a really really long time. He's an actor. No big deal, so. <laughs> oh, an no actor. biggie, no oh. biggie. He's an actor. He's an actor. Yeah. <laughs> uh, but what was it like for what you guys like? being on set? Uh, it was it was <laughs> a really a special project mm -hmm. to work on. Um, I mean, I know that's the only thing you've worked on, and I hope you know it was actually like genuinely really special. The people were all wonderful, mm -hmm. and it's also such a good story and such a good script. Um, yeah, no, it's wonderful. Graham, yeah. since you are the veteran on the set, do you want to <laughs> give any tips to Grace? Any acting tips at all? No, she nailed it. Like, yeah? You, you, wouldn't, you wouldn't be able to tell that it was her first time acting. It was, That's it not was crazy. true. But thank you. Oh, okay. Thank you for being nice. <laughs> um, but what was the prep like for you, Grace? Getting ready for this role, how did you really want to become Stargirl? Honestly, there was very little prep. Really? Like, there was no prep at all. I just kind of, I didn't think about it. I just heard about it and just jumped on a plane to New Mexico. <laughs> they dyed my hair, and uh, that's about it. And we just kind of got into it. I met Graham yeah. and Julia and the rest of the cast. And yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this is a story, of course, about your first love. So I'm curious to know, how did you guys find that bond together on set? Did you guys <laughs> go out for a burger? Like, how did you guys like find that chemistry together? So we, they put us in the same apartment complex. Okay. So we yeah. were able to actually hang out when we weren't filming yeah. as well, which was really cool. Mm -hmm. So it wasn't just. But I also don't think we were like, we need to like bond. Like yeah, we no. weren't like, oh, we need to bond. Yeah. It just kind of happened. Like when you're working on something that lasts that long mm -hmm. and we're co-stars, we're like equally in the movie. So. You, when you're spending that much time with someone, you just kind of become really close friends, I guess. Mm -hmm. Yeah. We do get to see a sweet on-screen first kiss. Were there butterflies on set before that scene? <laughs> Were there butterflies, Graham? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, that's always a... It's never not going to be awesome. <laughs> totally, totally. And that's why it's fun to talk about. <laughs> I don't think it was too... It wasn't, like... It wasn't... It wasn't, it wasn't terrible. Yeah. It wasn't like butterflies magical though. I mean, the movie, I think it's quite magical, but unfortunately the closed curtains, it was, it was. Yeah, and it's easy to remember, <laughs> it's part of the story. Exactly. Yes. And it's part, and it's the characters. Exactly, right? yeah, for exactly. sure. Exactly. Um, I do want to take us back on a little bit of a journey, Grace, because we've been with you from the very beginning. We actually yeah. have our ah. very first ET interview from 2016. No, with please, 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 please. We just please. have a little baby, baby surprise, please, no, baby surprise. Please, take a look. Please. <laughs> It's what I've been waiting for. I know, I don't want to say all my life because I'm only 12. I've only been here for 12 years. But in my 12 years of living, definitely one of the biggest, happiest moments of my life. You made Howie Mandel cry. See, this is why I need to watch the episode. <laughs> so many things happened that I don't see. It was like, oh my gosh. I can't believe you're so embarrassed because you're the cutest person in the entire world. Yo. <clears throat> thank you, really thank good. you so much for thank playing you. that. I really, really love really that. Awesome. I appreciate that so I know, much. I know. I feel like I'm gonna faint right now. <laughs> even, even though I embarrassed you, I do want to say thank you so much. <laughs> thank you both, so much for having being us. Here. Uh, now you guys can catch Grace and Graham in Star Girl when it's out, streaming on Disney Plus this Friday, March 13th. Guys, do not miss it at all. Uh, now it's time for our MVP, our most viral post. Kylie Jenner. Do it! Kylie really wanted to sing a song. Kylie, do it for me, please! Do it! Uh, 
that that is absolutely the thing I needed to see on social media I this weekend. I completely needed her singing Rise and Shine. Yes, of course, if you missed it, Kylie Jenner and her sisters, Kim, Chloe, and Courtney, all hit up a drag show yep. in Palm Springs. Check them out having the time of their lives. So much fun. But just when you thought the fun had reached its peak, yes. Kylie was put on the spot by Chloe. Chloe shoved the microphone in her face and she went ahead and gave, she gave us the line that we've all grown to know and love, rise and shine. Are you are you a fan of this? Do you think I, Kylie should be dropping music? Honestly, I think it's just a fun thing. If she wants to keep doing it, then go for it. Yeah. Um, I thought it was a fun viral moment when it first happened. I'm glad that it's died down a little bit, but now it's it's vintage social media. I mean, I, I don't know if it's vintage for much longer. I feel like we're just gonna keep hearing it in different capacities. I mean, and until she drops that Rise and Shine single. Yes. Like. I don't need any more of these little baby bits. You know, full song. Here's what I want to see next. I want to see a drag queen doing Kylie Jenner singing Rise and Shine. Wow. Can we put that out there? Wow, Deidre, you're just blowing my mind right now. Thank you, thank you, thank you. <laughs>